Hey guys, what's going on? Jamie here. Just wanted to do another quick update for you guys. Um, give you some information um, on a potential long-term project. I don't know if it's going to be long-term or not, but <laughs> um, I decided to uh, stake some of their tokens. We'll talk about that here in a second. Um, of course, everything I talk about on my videos is for entertainment purposes only. I'm certainly not giving you any type of advice. Um, you should do your own research, do your own due diligence. This is all risky stuff, guys. Let's be clear. Um, there are no guarantees out here. So if you're going to get into anything in crypto, just put in what you can afford to lose. Also, follow me on Telegram. <clears throat> I'll leave a link for that down below. And if you haven't subscribed to this channel, hit subscribe, hit the little bell icon so you'll get notified straight away whenever I do a brand new video. So let's just jump right into it, guys. Um, real quick, unbanked. Um, this is the block card. Some of you guys have uh, you know, seen me do videos on this already. In this particular video, I'm not really talking about the card itself. Although, if you're looking for a crypto debit card, this is certainly um, you know, the one that I recommend. This is the one that I personally use. Um, you can see here, you can get up to 6.38% in, in rewards back in crypto. And you can also buy, sell, and send crypto from your account to anyone else's uh, anyone else's account. So pretty cool stuff, but that's not what I'm here to talk about. I'm here to talk about this right here. They have <clears throat> they have uh, an NFT drop they're gonna be doing pretty soon. Um, you have time. Um, I think it's not gonna be until towards the end of the year. So probably the, within the next 30 or 60 days, something like that. Uh, this is pretty cool. They're gonna, they're gonna do a banker NFT drop. So Unbanked has commissioned a collection of 10,000 unique digital collectibles on the Ethereum blockchain from a previously successful NFT artist. The artist's previous NFT collection reached a market cap over $70 million with some unique pieces in the collection selling for over a million. Owning a banker will not only give you an ownership of a rare digital collectible, but will also come with unique access and functionality on one of Unbanked's uh upcoming DeFi products so so again not only do they have this crypto debit card they have other DeFi products that they're going to be launching next year so you'll have access to that if you hold one of their nfts um, stay up to date with the latest information by creating an unbanked account now so if you want to check this out <clears throat> i'll leave a, a link down below you just have to create an account um and then you'll get early access to all the info as we get closer to this nft drop Another thing I wanted to talk about real quick is the casino. You can see here that the, uh, the casino is live. So if you want to play um, and use your drip and, uh, you know, see if you can win some more, you can certainly do that. There's three games. There's coin flip, dice, and barbell roll. So this thing is live. It's working perfectly fine right now. I think there was, you know, it wasn't working too smooth when it first launched, but they fixed it. And I believe right now it's working perfectly fine. Uh, price of drip right now. Oops. Price of drip right now is $25.50. So yeah, pretty good stuff. Um, this right here, this is the ROI contract one factor. This one here has been blowing up. If you want to get in, 7% a day is what I'm getting. Um, I think I'm getting 7%. Yeah, 7% a day. So you can earn anywhere from 3% up to 7% depending on your plan. Made by the same people. Uh, the ADA factor, this one here is doing well. I'm also getting 7% with this one. This one, you can get 3% to 7%. Um, so if you want to get into a traditional ROI contract, these are the two that I'm in. And, uh, you know, comes from a trusted team. All right, guys. So this is right here, this Hobbs Network thing. Um, somebody sent me this the other day, and um, I was looking at it. <clears throat> Um, I really, I really didn't have much time to, you know, research it when they sent it to me because I was traveling like always every weekend. I'm on the road this weekend. I was in Ocean City, Maryland, um, so I was kind of running around a little bit. But when I took a look at it, um, you know, pretty interesting. You know, the token itself uh, was at twenty five dollars. Um, I believe it was at an, it hit an all time high of thirty dollars and change. Um, what's interesting though is when they were doing the pre-sale it was 50 cents so people who got in on the pre-sale um, or not i don't know if it was a pre-sale let me matter of fact let's take a quick look at the white paper it'll tell us exactly um so here's the token prices right here oops sorry about that let me make this bigger
So the private sale, it was 42 cents. The pre-sale, it was 50 cents. I was right, it was 50 cents. And then after the pre-sale, when they did their launch, it started at 50 cents. Now it's sitting right now at just under $20, pretty much $20, right? Um, so even though it went to an all-time high of, I believe, $30, I'll give you the exact number. I don't want to give you the wrong number here. Let's go to historical data. Um, is that where I look? Yeah, I think historical data, right? Um, no, it was it? Hmm, let me see here. Hi, what was the high for this? What's that? I think it was. $30. Just look right here. No, it wasn't actually the, the high was $25.45, I think. So it went to $25.45. Yeah, this is the 25 right here. $25.45. So this is what what uh it was. Let's take a look at this right here. So here took a little bit of a dip nice little correction here i guess people bought in right here and it's been climbing ever since there's been some peaks and you know peaks in the uh, there's been some valleys right here come up right here 25 then it came down a little bit it was at 17 18 dollars and uh this is what it looked like today when I saw this, it was around 18, not 18, it was at $25, give or take. I figured, you know what, let me see if it'll come down a little bit because I, you know, I'd like to buy it at a much less price. And uh, today it was at around 18 bucks. Yeah, see, you can see right here, it was at 18 bucks. It went all the way down to 17, 17 bucks. And then it started to come back up, right? So anyway, make a long story short, I went in and put uh, about twenty-five thousand dollars worth of, worth of this token, and I staked it over here on their platform. Um, now, if you're in my Telegram, I posted this link right here um, earlier today. You know, if you're not in my Telegram, why not get in there? That way, you get time-sensitive information. I'm, I'm making a video about this right now. It's almost nine p.m., and I posted about it. Matter of fact, let me show you. I'm making the video at 9 p.m. I posted the link here at 3.28 p.m. So you're getting this five hours later, <laughs> five hours later, just because you're not in our Telegram, right? So get in the Telegram. Anyway, make a long story short. Uh, we'll see how this pans out. I'll give you some updates as we move forward if you want to check this out. This is the white paper. Um, real quick, you can see here. Um, Stakeholder. I'm still looking into this, but here you can see stakeholder HNW release schedule. Thirty percent of the total supply has been allocated to stakeholder rewards. Twelve thousand HNW will be released once a week for six months. So there'll be twenty-five payouts. So you can see here, you know, people who are staking early, and this is brand new. I think it's only been live for a week, give or take. So we're just around right here. So people who are getting in right now, they're going to be getting a lot more rewards than people who are going to get in, get in later in this uh, six month time frame here. Um, because why? Because there's going to be a lot more participants, a lot more people. There's a lot more people going to know about this. They're going to be turning on the marketing, and and just like anything else, when there's more people getting in into it, um, there's going to be less. You know, this twelve thousand H and W that they're going to be releasing once a week. It's going to be distributed amongst way more people so people are people's share is going to be less right right now there isn't a lot of people so 12,000 h and w's being distributed amongst a few people and they're going to get the lion's share of this of course the more you stake the bigger the piece of the pie you're going to get you guys know that already we'll see how this pans out um stakeholders get paid um so again there's you know that's the buying of the token and uh staking it um, you know, it's just one avenue. There's a couple of other components to this, but I just wanted to introduce this to you. 
share this with you. I'll do a much more um, detailed review once I get my first weekly payout, then I can give you some more data. And then at that point, I'll do a much more detailed review and touch on everything. But I do want to have some hard data that I can show you. Can't give you that until I get my first payout. But I did put in $25,000 worth of HNW and staked it on their platform. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. Let's, we'll follow the price of this. Right now it's at 20 bucks. Um, you know, is this a hundred dollar token? I think there's potential because they do have a pretty tight community. If you watch any of my videos before, um, you know that community, right? To me, community, in my opinion, community is the single most important factor for it, for the success of a project and the price of a token, because that community can support that price and even drive that price. If there's a project that doesn't have a community. I don't care how great it is, how much use case it has. If it doesn't have community, if it doesn't have promotion, marketing, people are going to support that price. It's not going to do well and vice versa. If you have a crappy token, but it has a community behind it, like Dogecoin, right? Or, or Shiba Inu, right? Like they don't, they're just meme coins. They don't really have any use case, but there's a community that's supporting it and it's driving that price. What if you have both? What if you have, what if you have use case and you have um, a tight community, right? So this potentially can be a hundred dollar coin, hundred dollar token rather. Um, so we'll see, you know, time will tell. Um, but yeah, it'll be very, very interesting. So anyway, watch for my full review. Again, once I get my first, you know, payout from staking. I'll have hard data. I'll do a full review at that point, but did want to put this on your radar because you can stake and or hold this right now, hold this token right now. So again, I'm always on the lookout for good passive opportunities and uh, this one might be a good one. Anyway, I'll catch you in the next video, guys. Again, subscribe to my channel. Follow me on Telegram. Risk capital only, guys. And I'll catch you soon. Peace.